A remarkable observation by the James Wood Space Telescope has recently captivated the scientific community and stirred considerable excitement among researchers around the globe. The telescope detected an unusual pattern of light emissions in the vastness of space and observation unlike anything previously recorded. These lights, observed from an immense distance of approximately 7 billion kilometers from Earth, bear a striking resemblance to the glow typically associated with artificial urban lighting. This entirely unforeseen finding has reignited curiosity and speculation about the existence of intelligent life beyond our planet. The focus of this intriguing discovery is Proxima Centauri b, the nearest known exoplanet to Earth orbiting the Red dwarf star Proxima Centauri, from this distant world, the telescope picked up the presence of exceptionally bright lights emanating from the surface, prompting immediate questions about their origin. Could these strange illuminations be the result of natural geological processes, or do they suggest the presence of advanced life forms capable of generating artificial light? The possibility that such signals might originate from an extraterrestrial Civilization has long fascinated scientists and the public alike. Humanity has, for generations, pondered the age-old question of whether we are alone in the universe. Across decades of scientific inquiry and technological progress, researchers have persistently searched for any sign, however small, that life might exist beyond Earth. Every potential indication of such a discovery has been welcomed with eager anticipation. Most recently, the scientific world was taken by surprise when the James Wood Space Telescope, during its continuous monitoring of distant celestial bodies, recorded data that many believe could mark the beginning of a new chapter in astrobiology. The data included consistent patterns of light that resemble those seen in urban environments on Earth. These lights, viewed from afar, appear to form structured patterns similar to those seen in human-made cities, something that had never before been documented in space. The discovery has caused a stir within the scientific community. The thought that an alien civilization might be generating these lights has left many researchers both astonished and deeply curious. The implications are enormous. If this data is confirmed, it could mean that intelligent life forms have developed. Complex societies somewhere far beyond our solar system societies that are now revealing themselves through the glow of their civilizations. Some scientists have begun to speculate how long these lights might have been shining in the void of space, potentially unnoticed for eons until human technology advanced enough to detect them. Engineers and astronomers at NASA and other research institutions are now asking how long such signals might have existed and whether our current technological capabilities are only just beginning to catch up with phenomena that have been present for centuries or even millennia, one of the voices. Contributing to the discussion is David Kipping, an astronomer from Columbia University. He has described Proxima Centauri IB as a particularly intriguing exoplanet due to its unusual thermal behavior. Unlike conventional rocky planets that absorb radiation from their parent star and re-emit it as infrared heat, Proxima Centauri IB displays unexpected thermal characteristics. The difference in the way it emits infrared radiation especially when compared to the typical emissions expected from a planet orbiting a red dwarf like Proxima Centauri has provided scientists with a valuable opportunity for study. These thermal anomalies have made Proxima be an ideal target for the James Wood Space Telescope, which is equipped with highly sensitive instruments designed to detect and analyze infrared wavelengths. The telescope's capacity to observe in the infrared spectrum allows it to study the thermal signature of Proxima Centauri IB in great detail, which is essential for understanding the planet's atmosphere and potential to support life. The thermal patterns identified on the planet offer clues about the gases that make up its atmosphere, its temperature dynamics, and even surface or subsurface activity that could hint at geological or biological processes, leveraging its advanced. Infrared imaging systems, the telescope enables scientists to examine whether this distant world might have the right conditions to harbor life. 
By capturing even the faintest traces of light in the darkness of space, the telescope is ideally suited to search for artificial illumination or signs of energy use that could indicate intelligent activity. The lights identified on Proxima Centauri B could be artificial in nature, possibly the result of technological systems not unlike those on Earth. The telescope's ability to detect such faint signals is due to its operation within an extraordinarily narrow band of the light spectrum, making it thousands of times more precise than instruments designed to observe starlight alone. The observed interaction between Proxima Centauri and its planet also adds complexity to the situation. The planet's day side is believed to receive steady exposure to its host star, possibly powering surface systems or harvesting energy, while the night side remains in near constant darkness and extreme cold. This stark temperature contrast, governed largely by atmospheric composition, is a topic of great interest to astronomers. Through sustained observation, the telescope is helping to piece together how energy is distributed on the planet and whether its atmosphere retains heat, transports it, or supports any form of climate. Adding to its advantages, the James Wood Space Telescope's orbital position relative to Earth allows for extended and consistent monitoring of Proxima Centauri b's full planetary rotation. Within just over 11 Earth days, scientists can observe both the daytime and nighttime hemispheres of the exoplanet, allowing for a complete picture of its environmental conditions. The next logical step in this exploration is to thoroughly assess the chemical composition of the planet's atmosphere. Researchers are particularly focused on identifying key gases such as oxygen, methane, and water vapor, each of which can serve as potential markers for life. The detection of such gases would represent a major breakthrough and significantly strengthen the case for Proxima Centauri b being capable of supporting living organisms or even advanced civilizations. However, this is no simple task detecting. These gases requires the precise measurement of how light from the star passes through the planet's atmosphere, a method known as transmission spectroscopy. While the James Wood Space Telescope is well equipped to analyze certain compounds, especially water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane, it has notable limitations when it comes to detecting oxygen, which is a crucial biomarker. Despite this challenge, scientists are exploring alternative indicators such as ozone, a byproduct of oxygen, which might be easier to detect and still provide valuable evidence pointing toward biological processes. These indirect methods, while more complex and prone to ambiguity, still offer hope that we may eventually uncover signs of life, yet it is important to acknowledge the limits of current technology. The James Wood Space Telescope, though powerful, cannot observe every potentially habitable world. Its capabilities are best suited to studying exoplanets relatively close to Earth, which restricts the scope of its search. In light of these limitations, astronomers are turning to next-generation ground-based observatories such as the extremely large telescope ELT, expected to become operational in 2028. Instruments like the ELT will enhance our ability to conduct detailed atmospheric studies of exoplanets that lie farther away and may hold further secrets. Looking ahead, researchers are also developing new space telescopes with the express purpose of advancing exoplanetary research. These future observatories aim to refine techniques that reduce interference from host stars, allowing for more accurate studies of how planets reflect light. One of the major scientific challenges in this endeavor is the need to distinguish between gases produced by life and those generated by non-biological processes such as volcanic activity. This differentiation is critical to avoid false positives and to establish a clearer understanding of whether a planet's environment is shaped by living organisms. Despite all these difficulties, scientific progress continues, the James Wood. Space Telescope, with all its advantages and shortcomings, represents a significant advancement in humanity's quest to comprehend the universe. It brings us closer to answering the age-old question that has haunted scientists and dreamers alike, are we truly alone in the universe? 
After countless missions, observations, and decades of exploration, a definitive answer remains elusive. Yet the discovery of unusual lights on Proxima Centauri IB adds a new dimension to the search and offers a tantalizing hint that the answer might finally be within reach.